Sabay sabay po tayo sa bilang ng tatlo, dalawa, isa. Karapatan ng mamamayan ipaglaban. Tinatawagan po natin si Peter Murphy, ang nahalal na Secretary General ng International Coalition on Human Rights and Peace in the Philippines. Magandang hapon sa inyo ang lahat. Militant greetings to the people Sona from the International Conference for Human Rights and Peace in the Philippines. Over 260 delegates from 27 countries came together to organize a powerful, sustained international campaign to expose the human rights abuses in the Philippines. Our campaign starts today by attending this people Sona. We must end the impunity that allows the Philippines government to be accepted as part of the international community when under this Aquino presidency there are already 142 cases of extrajudicial killings, 164 cases of frustrated murder and 64 cases of disappearances, over 400 political prisoners. Unarmed civilians are being killed and disappeared for acting for the people's interests. We condemn the political killings related to the opposition to large-scale mining, the killing of peasant and worker leaders, of people working for typhoon relief. All of this is total abuse of your rights to life, to freedom, guaranteed by international law and the Philippines Constitution. We condemn the repression of the right to organize a trade union and to negotiate a collective bargaining agreement and to strike. Trade union repression is rampant in the Philippines. Mabuhay mga manggagawa sa Pentagon Steel Corporation. We condemn the neoliberal policy of the Aquino government that allows massive demolition of urban poor communities and privatization of hospitals. We condemn the grinding poverty of 80 million Filipino people. This is a breach of human rights. It's linked to the neoliberal policies of this government and its long-term domination by the United States capitalists. We call for the end of the US military presence in this country and all other countries outside the United States. We call for the end of the notorious upland by any hand that unleashes a military against its own people. We call for the release of all political prisoners and the beginning of the peace talks again between the National Democratic Front and the government of the Philippines. These must commence immediately in good faith. We know the people of the Philippines are hungry for food and hungry for peace. We are so proud to stand here today in solidarity with you in your protest and to assert with you against these police the right to protest your democratic right, our democratic right. Karapatang ng mamayan! Ipaglaban! Ipaglaban! Karapatang ng mamayan!